New information tonight as the Wise County Sheriff's Office continues to investigate the double murder of a mother and her daughter. We now know when and where the daughter last went to school, seemingly the last moments anyone saw her in public. 45 year old Robert Moriarty was arrested and charged with murder, capital murder and tampering with a corpse Monday. He is accused of killing his wife, Kimberly Kellum, and their 11 year old daughter. Moriarty is also accused of hiding their bodies in the garage of their home. When the two were killed is still unknown, but according to Wise County Sheriff Lane Aiken, their bodies had been decomposing for at least five to six months. Tonight, we're told the young girl, including her two siblings, were enrolled at Boyd Independent School District in Wise County in January 2021. However, in August 2021, the students did not show up for class. Boyd ISD Superintendent Leslie Van tells us they called Moriarty and Kellum to check on the children. Van says the parents of three told the district that their children were now attending an online school. Boyd ISD was able to verify this and said Moriarty and Kellum unenrolled from Boyd ISD then. Now today we spoke to a friend of Kellum. She says that Kellum was a free spirit and she will be deeply missed. I'm a better person because Kim was my friend. The world's a better place because she left a legacy. And the evil took it, took her from people that cared <laughs> and people that loved her. Moriarty is in jail tonight on an $800,000 bond. The other two children, the siblings of that daughter, is with Child Protective Services. Kellum and her daughter's bodies were sent to the Dallas Medical Examiner's Office, and those autopsies were done today, according to Sheriff Aiken. We are still waiting on those results. In Wise County, I'm Natalie Haddad.